Well, good evening, and it's the 14th of July, 7 p.m., and I'm on Jersey Marine Beach. It is absolutely beautiful over here. The tide, as you can see, is ebbing. That means it's going out, and there's uh, nobody here, nobody on the beach. I'll just swing around there now to show you the scene into Abraban. Britain Ferry and I'll swing around again slowly and right behind me now you can see a few people there, fishermen, people lighting fires for an evening's drinking session <laughs> and a uh, couple having a walk but it's just peaceful it's hard to explain isn't it you know the difference between this atmosphere here and living in London you know <laughs> Oxford Street you know all right fair enough these cities are always like that and when you go to them you, you don't expect that but to experience this open air fresh air and you're on your own, you've got time to dream, time to think, and just walk, walk and walk. The beach is looking a bit dirty at the moment, we've got some, these high tides have been bringing up a lot of coal dust, and debris from the estuary, uh, the Neath estuary, and the River Tawi, which is behind me. Right over there in the distance is Devon and Cornwall and it's pretty clear tonight to get over there now you'd have to go all the way up the M4 over the River Severn bridges and join the M5 and down the M5 to get over to that there which is some 10 miles to it. <laughs> Well, you can see now these flowers are taking shape. These will enhance the bottom of these dunes, trap the sand blowing, and that's what builds these dunes up. That's all they need now is a drop of water, but they ain't gonna get that for the next week. But they're very resilient plants due to these hot climates and sandy conditions. Well, I'm, I'm at the highest point of the dunes now, and you can see there, uh, I think that's something in the region of 30 feet high. It might not look like it on the camera, but I believe in me, it's, it's about 20, 20, I think, 20, 30 feet high. And building up every year, all the way down there, towards the River Neath estuary. Of course, this will protect the main roads and the 483 is just beyond there. When the high tides in the winter come, these should be enough to stop the flooding. There's a lovely shot of Mumble's Head way out in the distance there. The sun is setting now. In a couple of hours, it'll be dark. And I think it's time I started to get my way back home.